like this shooting on Marco. What is this? Uh it's 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 not what it looks like. There's no way the guy you saw Langston with could have been Marco. No, he was older. Mr. G, was it? Ew, no. So who? That hot guy who teaches at LU. I think his name is Ford. Is that what it looks like? Because it looks to me like you were having sex with a pizza girl. Calm down, okay? You have the wrong I idea. I left my prom to come here. I was about to break up with a guy who actually cares about me because I wanted to be with you. And then I hear Christian talking about you hooking up with the pizza girl? Um, hello, I have a name. Lacey, but... will you just give me a chance? I'll explain everything. Why? How can I trust you again? You can. No. Just hear me out. I've got a lot to say and no shoulder to lean on. No one for my soul to bleed on. You gotta believe me. This is all a big misunderstanding. Please believe me. How long has this been going on? Have you been playing me this whole time? You're not listening to me. No, no, no. I'm listening to you. I'm just not buying it because it's bull. Okay. All right. Here's what happened tonight. I, I call to order a pizza. Karen shows up, she sees that I'm missing you, and she pounces. What? I, uh, she started kissing me and then taking off her clothes and taking off my clothes. Langston, I'm only human. You're only full of it. It was a weak moment. I had no intention of it ending up like this. I wish I could believe that. Don't. You know better. On the other hand, you are the same girl that left a great guy like Marco for this jerk. Would I say something like this if I wasn't, like, a thousand percent sure? Marco. Where's Destiny? So, I guess I made my point? I guess you did. Destiny! And you see, the girl is busy. What's wrong? I need to talk to you. I'm sorry, man. It's important. <sighs> oh, 
almost time to crown the king and queen anyway. I should go get ready. Don't take too long. Don't worry. Like the man said, just call my name and I'll be there. What's the matter? Tell me everything you know about Langston and Ford. How could you sleep with her? How could you sleep with her after you told me you loved me? Well, one thing has nothing to do with the other. Are you kidding me? For I asked you if you were sleeping with anyone else, and you said no. Because I wasn't. Lexan, tonight was the first time. <laughs> no. No, I think you knew exactly what you were going to get when you ordered your deluxe thin crust. I mean, why can't you just man up and admit you've been cheating on me? Because I wasn't. Lexan, this didn't mean anything to me. Well, it means something to me. For months, every time I was with you, I died a little inside. I hated going behind Marco's back, but I cared about you too much to let you go. I, I, I care about you, too. Mm -mm. Because if you can jump into bed with any woman and say that it means nothing, then obviously I don't mean anything either. Don't you ever say that you don't matter, because you do. Sometimes I wish you didn't. That's my problem, Langston. <laughs> That's supposed to make sense, because it doesn't. Tonight with Karen never should have happened. I only did it because of you. I saw it, Destiny. I was going through some rehearsal footage, and all of a sudden there was a conversation between you and Matthew. What were we talking about? Blank's in a fort. You said she was cheating on me with him. Well, maybe I got the wrong idea. How? Destiny, either Langston was cheating, or she wasn't. Well, but what if it was for the play? It, the play? Yeah, Langston needed help with the scene, so she asked Ford to help her ha act it out. Just tell the truth, Des. A couple of weeks ago, I saw Langston and Ford here. But they didn't know I was here. So what were they doing? Kissing. How is it my fault that you cheated on me? I've never cared about a girl the way I care about you, Langston. And it makes me a little crazy. All I could think about tonight was, was you dancing with Marco, his hands all over you, and then you sleeping with him afterwards. You told me you were okay with that. I did. I, I thought I was. But I, I couldn't take it. So when I texted you and you left me hanging, I called Karen. And I knew it, it was a mistake as soon as I dialed her number. But now you know why. And uh, you, you, you have to give me another chance. I mean, don't you know what it's like to screw up? So where's life now? I don't know. I, I saw her earlier, but now I'm not sure. Yeah, me too. I'm sure she's around here somewhere. Hey, maybe we could find stars. She could tell you where to find Langston. You looking for Langston? Have you seen her? Yeah, she left. When? I don't know. A while ago. I think I know where to find her. Come on.